Most people in life are familiar with the term narcissist. A narcissist is a very selfish individual, and a narcissist likes to play with people. A narcissist will stalk a woman who is intelligent and smart, but study her like an art, and find a way in that he feels is clever. I once had a friend in a network marketing organization whose husband was a total narcissist, and basically by the time of year seven, he was already dallying in other things, other people, other you-know-whats, and openly he left her high and dry after creating his own bank accounts, allegedly, and doing other things. But what we know about men like that is that they don't want their ex-wives to go on to love and kindness. So what he might have done was start to swallow his pride, not at all, but start to school someone in what to do to play with someone he wanted to play with despite having a marvelous wife who almost looks like her. The truth is that men like to share stories about their families. And women like to be in power over men that they think are powerful. But usually the narcissist and the masochist are the marvelous, marvelous liars. And what they end up doing is taking the soul and the heart of the women who are supposed to be with someone else. So when this story breaks, my guess is we're going to have a lot of physical abuse on a beautiful girl who never deserved it. And what we know about siblings in a set of families is that they're more interested and trying to keep their mom pumped full of shit instead of preparing her for heaven's gates. As a pagan and as a priest, I'm offended. And I do hope that the police officers who are of the military stead go after the people like those people who feel they have the right to steal, lie, and cheat out of people out of a heritage bed.